Oh, shit. This is my 2004 Subaru Impreza WRX Turbo. The last month or so, she's been making a few noises. The engine light is on. She has a slow puncher, desperate for a service. Coolant leak, the clutch is slipping. I think it's time for a clutch. The list goes on. Okay, I know what you're thinking. I have countless custom motorcycles at my disposal to ride all this summer and I choose to drive around in an old souped up boy racer car with a baked bean can exhaust pipe and a dump valve. Especially when there's a huge list of problems and I'm constantly worried about her breaking down on me. What am I doing? Have I mentioned this is a love story? The Subaru love story started when I was 10. PlayStation 1 ruled mine and my brother's lives. We spent hours racing our favourite rally cars. Over the years, the bond grew stronger. And he's set up. Oh, and rolls the final tipping point was seeing what Ken Block could do in his Subaru in the early Jim Carner videos. When I was 19, I finally saved enough money to buy my own Subaru. Due to insurance costs, I had to settle for an X-Reg 2.0-litre non-turbo GX model, but I didn't care. I owned a Subaru. Almost 10 years later, and I have a slightly newer, slightly faster blob eye with a huge list of problems. I came so close to just selling her and making it someone else's problem, but instead, I held my breath and ordered all the parts I needed and gave a good friend a call. Adam. I took a short drive to St. Neots, and the work began. had a turbo actuator, four new tyres, full service and MOT, a radiator, header tank, coolant, a clutch, wipers, wheel bearing and a headlight bulb. And she feels like a new car. 